mine. Hey then. I'm gonna let it shine. Hey then. Oh, hi. Aiden, why do you have light bulbs in your ears? What? Why do you have light bulbs in your ears? I can't hear you. I have light bulbs in my ears. Give me those. Hey. Now, what is this about? I'm trying to light my world. Your what? You know, I'm trying to light my world. I don't get it. Well, I was reading that verse in Acts where it says, I have made you a light, but God must have forgot about me or mine broke, because no matter how hard I tried, I couldn't get myself to glow, so I'm just faking it. And that's why the light bulbs were in your ears? Yeah. Did it work? Not exactly. Besides that, I think you're a little con... No worries. I have a plan B. But, but, Aiden... Almost there. Can I interest you in a light bulb? Where did you get these from? Your house. <gasps> My house? Don't worry. I only took the ones from your lamp. Of course, that would be all the expense. I knew you wouldn't mind. They were old anyway. Oh, by the way, be careful when you go home. It's awfully dark in there. For starters, give these back to me. But I need them to light my world. Oops. You can have them. They're Gonna do me a lot of good now. I'm glad you feel that way. So we can put all this behind us. Get back here. Come back here. We need to talk. Am I in trouble? No, Aiden. I just want to explain something to you. Okay. The verse you are talking about is found in Acts 13, verse 47. It says... For this is what the Lord commanded us. I have made you a light for the Gentiles, that you may bring salvation to the ends of the earth. It looks like your light went out too. Pay attention, Aiden. What the verse means is that we're supposed to tell others about Jesus and what he has done for us. That's easy to do when you get to know him. Huh? Think about Cody, your best friend, right? Yeah, we play video games and eat pizza together. He's the bestest friend ever. He's so nice that he even let me ride his bike before. We've spent lots of time together. You'd like him a lot. Well, that's how it works with Jesus. I have to play games and eat pizza with him, too. I can do that. Oh, that's not exactly what I mean. You become best friends with Jesus by spending time with him in prayer and by reading your Bible. And the better you get to know Jesus, the more you bursting to tell others the good news. When you tell others about his love for them and the sacrifices that he has made, you help light the way. Kind of like fireworks. Ah, uh, I guess you could put it that way. I'm going to go read my Bible right now. Can I interest you in some candles? You took my candles too? <laughs>